All right, so got a nice empty screen there because I'm, I'm doing this by myself. Is there anyone helping me film? I said I would do a really immediate video of uh, shooting the Crytek Trident uh, Mark II. Um, got this thing like five or six years ago, back when it was new. Like I said, all I've got on here is a reflex or a red dot sight because the irons are not flip up and they're in the way in the real world. You would want to keep your irons on because this can easily be shot out. Even an airsoft pellet will shatter this. So then, or if your battery dies, like you're an idiot or something. Uh, but anyways, you know, just to get right to it, um, these are those uh, cheapo mags that e-bike was selling a few years ago with the, the fake looking brass and them. I ate them, but I got a bunch of them. So here it goes. Um, like I said before, on this gun, you pull back the charging handle. All it's going to do is show you the hop up. And I've already got it set to where I want it for right now. So on this gun, the working bolt catch, all it does is pulls that little piece of shit, uh, fake bolt the dust cover because like I said don't want to get a bunch of um, crap in there all right so I got a couple targets set up like I don't know 20 feet away let's see what I thought um, let's see is this semi so I've got two targets right tell where I'm hitting is too far away and I also moved this red dot around. Give me one sec. <clears throat> I definitely need to readjust this sight. It's shooting really high. So let's go down a little bit. And now with some full auto. Then back to single or semi just because you want to relax that spring a little bit. Alright, I think that's enough. And safe. Turn off your red dot so you don't play your battery. This is a cheapo matrix. It's got a red and green dot. Supposedly with five different brightness levels, but that's a bunch of shit because they're all the exact same. But that's what you get for a thirty-dollar red dot. And that's all you need for airsoft. You know, you're just trying to get close, close enough to hit the target. So let's go take a look real quick at the actual target. Oh. There's the gun in all its glory. All right, had a little fun there. I know, it's the basement, it's the man cave, whatever you wanna call it. I had to demo a bunch of it back when I first got the house. Yep, there's the old bathroom. But uh, up in the corner here, I was going for this sport bad guy. All right, yeah, I didn't even put one on that one to the right. Okay. So when I first started shooting, you could see a lot of that stuff was up high. Um, I didn't adjust the sight. I just aimed a little lower. And uh, I just wrecked that thing um, with the automatic shooting. And probably tore up the wall behind it a little bit. But I don't really care because this is a non-functioning uh, bathroom that was in this house. Um, and I use it as a space for target practice. All right, Trident, uh, well, it's a Crytek Trident Mark II, Mark II, uh, shooting, bye.